Hello gang, welcome to the channel again and today we are here with the Krakoan Winter update uh, It just landed like uh, less than 24 hours and we're gonna we're here first to showcase our girl Magic and Okay, we had some technical issues and yes, the problem with Magic is that we are talking about a character that actually cost money. It's like 20 bucks, 20 euros, whatever, and 10 tokens in the end of the week. Or you can go up front and give 30 and get the character, uh, get the uniform right away. Uh, here, old uniform and the other uniforms was a long time ago. There is no way with here old uniform she performs. Uh, you know, now she's tier 3, uh, so yeah, let's go through the uniform she took and see what I figured out during my live stream yesterday. You can go there and see uh, my live reactions on the character model and stuff. Uh, but here, let's figure out a rotation. Uh, the thing I figure out basically, it's like you need to drop 3, let it a bit, for cancel into fifth skill. Here, fifth skill got these demons comes out of this door into limbo, and here skills looks dope, looks dope. There is no Christmas on them for sure. I mean, she should drop snow, she should drop something with Christmas, uh, but all the effects looks really nice. Looks like Final Fantasy or something. Here sword. Uh, looks dope here uniform with the leather outfit. It's really cool. I mean the effects uh, Look at this. She's throwing this thing in front into her fourth skill The only thing that really matters in my opinion at the moment uh, For being into the meta it's her fourth skill and I'm gonna drop uh, I'm gonna do a breakdown right after on that uh, here skills basically got no pro got a proc on the second skill here there is a proc so you can take advantage of that do something like this but that's something a really long shot so here rotation mainly uh, the rotation I'm going to use it's three cancel four cancel five and after that I'm throwing a bit a two. And if I have the tier 3, I'm doing exactly the same, but cancelling everything into my tier 3. And yes, there is no Christmas spirit on it, there is no uh, Winter spirit on it, but in the same time, guys, you pay 30 euros and you get this badass girl. I mean, look at this sword, it's huge, it's, this, it's the same size with uh, herself. Uh, here, here feels kind off, but still, uh, this this pants and this change here. I mean, she's the girl I, I I would like to date on my high school on or something like that. Cheers, and yeah, she's nice, but twenty for that for just being nice. I mean, yeah. Mm, nope, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I, that's why I'm doing this thing here. This breakdown. Okay, this is the proc I was talking about. Uh, the third skill gives you a barrier. Okay, uh, here fourth skill. Here fourth skill feels. I was talking about that uh, into the parts notes. Feels really weird having all resistances. On it, but in the same time got fracture. So remember that. Remember that if you are one of the guys did tier four storm or Thor, remember when you try to find a striker to perform for your tier four skills, the only striker you could be able to find out was Deadpool to have a fracture ability on the fourth skill and having the order. So she is like. The only, the only order character to have this ability. Uh, let me let me show you what I'm talking about. When you're going here and you have a tier four, I know this is a problem for tier fours. Okay, the only order character in the, your whole roster 
having fracture ability is here. That, uh, that's what I find uh, the use. I find basically Madman uh, into uh, my live stream figured this out that C is the only character that got fracture and C is order. So that's the only, only use for her being meta in at the moment. You know, uh, part of the meta and at least. And in the same time, C is decreasing all resistances. And that's really weird. For the character, it's totally useless. The character got no elemental damage and decreased all resistances. 30% means that this skill do nothing for magic herself. So perhaps Net Marble wants to push a group of characters that they're gonna be good only for striking on the tier 4s or something like that. I'm not sure yet. I tried that. No difference for World Boss Legend, you know, if you use Thor with another striker and if you use here, <clears throat> I didn't find any huge difference. But in the same time, <clears throat> gives you the Fracture ability, which is really useful for ABL uh, cancelling through the Fracture with your striker skill. So, yeah, it was a bit of uh, advertisement for her striking ability, but for the rest... I mean, yeah, I give here that build, you can see here, for Fungry Hulk, a Nobelisk, a normal uh, uniform, and let's go to see here performance in ABX, in World Boss Legend now, and Mephisto. I'm gonna show you how I tried to uh, utilize the character, and see any value on my 30, Worm bugs drop there, and yeah, at the moment, yeah, I, I'm not, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna talk about how I feel before I show you the gameplay. Yeah, let's go through the gameplay. Okay, let's start from somewhere. Let's start from now. Now stage thirty. I'm using support of Riri Williams, uh, Iron Heart, and I'm trying to proc on this girl. And you can see the proc looks promising. One and a half bar without a CTP. Yay! Like, there is no way she can do stage 50. Uh, at least with my build. Uh, it's right here, stage 30. Because I felt like stage 50 was so long shot. She was doing no damage at all. So, yeah. I drop it a bit. Hydrate yourself, guys. Even at Winder, we need to drink water. Most of the people stop drinking water at the Winder. And it's legit because there's no worm to need it. But your body needs it. Yeah, you can see 11 bars on one minute. Mm, and yeah, I'm not saying that I'm proking perfectly. But you have seen me test multiple characters. I mean, how bad could my gameplay be? Uh, so a character could, uh, you know, uh, perform so bad. I mean, I need 40 seconds to pass the three minutes left and she still struggle. Your damage looks disgusting, guys. Yeah, her damage looks disgusting. I mean, a character 2022 20, could at least do this with like uh, 1 minute and 30 seconds left or something. I mean, see, he feels so bad. Her procs feels like 1 to 2 bars without the tier 3 and the tier 3 drops and it's like 3 to 4 bars max. And it's stage 30 and I have 25% peers. I didn't show you here stats, I'm gonna show you here stats right after, but believe me guys, I just spent for here, I want here to be good, I want here to perform, and if I was believe that if I give here uh, CTP, um, I'm not sure, I'm not sure what results we could have, I mean, uh, here build at the moment looks like that because I didn't show you, so 
with that stats, she's capped on critical damage, okay, she's missing some critical rate, but still, she's close to be, you know, to have a maximum build, uh, she's missing the CTP, of course, so yes, I'm gonna show you the rest of the, the rest of the gameplay on the other game modes, but you saw there, I, I was really, I was having really trouble to do uh, stage 30, Look at this, I mean, I'm in, in bar 32 and it's 2 minutes and 50 seconds left. This takes too long, guys. There's no way she can do uh, way better with that build. I mean, yeah. She is off. She is kind of off. And... <clears throat> And let's see what she's gonna do uh, against Mephisto. It's again Mephisto stage 30. <laughs> okay, let's see against stage 30 Mephisto now. And yeah, let's see. Um, yes, let's not spoil it for you. But yeah, I feel like the damage she's doing is really bad here too. Uh, stage 30 is low stage for my account. Um, ho however, my gameplay was good or bad. Uh, this shouldn't be that hard for here. But you can see, while, while we're seeing the video and you're seeing me trying to to proc, I'm gonna tell you that giving this 30 for this character felt like to me, I was talking about that on uh, the live stream yesterday also, I mean, if you, if you put out the value, I already told you, as a striker, having the fracture ability for Storm and Thor, uh, giving them the opportunity to utilize an order character and get the maximum buff out of their tier 4 and the fracture I can't see any other value for the character let me know down below in the comments I'm gonna drop a comment I'm gonna pin it on the top and I want you to drop down below your opinion on how, what CTP I should put and test here on um, for World Boss Legend, ABX, Timeline Battle, whatever you want, you know, drop a CD of Regeneration, Timeline Battle, or whatever. But you can see, I'm still in this, in the first phase, and it's 1 minute and 30 seconds left. Whatever uh, wrong things I was doing with the rotation, this is no, this is n nothing close than the meta character we have now. I feel the damage of here, it's in the level of Riri Williams. But in the same time, look at that, 3 minutes left and I just end the first phase. This is insanely slow. Yeah, see, I feel like she got pretty much the same damage with Riri Williams, but Riri Williams got value as a support. So yeah, it's really, really bad. It's really a waste. And giving the money 30s for that I felt like, uh, you know, uh, like I was having like uh, some money left on my pockets and I went to a bar and I was like you know what it's a good idea to drink some beers let's spend money uh, let's spend my money to drink some beers and when I took uh, when I start drinking I was happy and drink and drink and I got drunk went to my house fell asleep woke up in the morning and I was like with the, the hands on the pockets and like oh my god I waste my money last night because now, you know, in the morning, you're not drunk anymore, so you feel like, oh my god, what a waste. That's what I feel like with my magic. I bought here for 30, it was, I was looking at here, oh my god, this leather pants. Oh my god, this huge sword. Oh my god, these skills feel so cool. But now I'm like, oh my god, I waste 30. <laughs> so, yeah, guys, so yeah, do me a favor, give me some value here, give me some... YouTube boost algorithm, smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, let me know in the comments how you want me to test more the character, what CDP you wanna see, what else, you know, other game modes, 
I'm gonna do a showcase here uh, with no CDP for Alliance Bottle Extreme also and yes I'm not gonna test here on Timeline Bottle I feel like here value for PvP it's only with here artifact because here artifact gives here uh, the opportunity to stay alive but still the um, <clears throat> look at this the buffs is taking as a tier 3 when it tier 3 here the buffs it took was nothing uh, was nothing impressive it was like 15,000 HP and in the same time she took like 20,000 energy attack okay let's go to the last one uh, the last piece of gameplay I have kept here and it's against uh, Surtur on a Lance Battle Legend it was the day of uh, Newton's blast type she got exactly the same tags with Storm so yes she got some potentials for a Lance Battle Legend but let me know if in the comments as I already told you if you want me to put a rage on here a test here here but look at this this is the score I'm pulling out with storm uh, tier 3 level 80 so do I feel like she can replace storm in my account anyhow no if I build here like crazy put I mean 16 20 audience blessing a brilliant rage uh, there's no way she can do this score in my opinion uh, but let me know uh, let me show you what I was able to pull out here uh, with a proc and my clumsy rotation of course it's the first day uh, you know checking the character so yeah my gameplay could be better day by day but look at this this is like 450k and this is 4.5 million it's 10 times more so and I'm in the end of the buff of Odin Force this means like I have done half of my damage I could do in this run I mean it's 1 minute 30 seconds left so yeah let me know in the comments guys if you want me to test here with the raids on that but that's the first flavor you could have from the character uh, you know without a uh, raids and without a build what she can perform you can see she got the fracture ability so yeah if you compare here with Cyclops she is better 100% she is better but still is this enough uh, for the guys that don't have anyone any character for this day Perhaps, perhaps, but I feel like she's worse than Psylock. Psylock already is in the game and she's performing uh, like 2.5, 3.2. I've seen people doing that with mighty judgments, with rages. So Psylock feels like a better solution and she was already in the game and you don't need to pay 30 euros for it or 20 euros but yeah look at this i end up doing more than 1 million on this world boss so if you are looking for something like that yeah magic can provide you that if you are looking for striker with order and fracture magic can provide you that do you believe that if i build here with the raids yeah i feel yeah look at this okay it's uh 1.1 million let's say if i give here a raid and maximum build she could double the score and do like 2.2 but my storm did 4.4 and okay let's pretend like if i play perfectly let's say 3 million yeah that's the max that's the max i i'm not seeing any way she can perform way better so yes at the moment guys in my opinion she feels totally waste of money totally 100 percent the only thing it's the fracture thing on her fourth skill uh the the skill that they forget to remove the all resistance or they put it on purpose so they put a, a type of characters that they could be good for striking on our tier fours 
I'm not sure. I'm not sure that what they're planning to do. Uh, at the moment, C is totally bad. I mean, if you have here artifact, you could go and test here for PvP, but with this HP, this HP, guys, for a tier 3 character is really bad. Really bad. And let me show you another tier 3 character. Uh, I mean, yeah, 86,000. Okay, Emma has some build on. Okay, let's go. 68. So... Iceman got 10,000 uh, more. Professor X, okay, Professor X is a bad example. Uh, let's see, okay, let's see Magnus. F okay, so C is kind of fat, I guess. Uh, yeah. But generally, 59,000 HP is nothing. I mean, I, I wish I had the artifact and test here proper for PvP also. But at the moment, I mean, yeah, I feel so disappointed for my choice buying here. So yes, it's up to you guys. Let me know down below in the comments how you want to see Magic Sign. You want me to put a Mighty Destruction and go through more World Boss Legend? You want me to test here with Mighty Raids, with a normal Raids, whatever. I'm going to do some more testing. Uh, the next thing I'm going to showcase is Magneto. As you can see, I'm really close to level 80. And I'm going to do a comparison level 70, 80, D1, I guess. So yeah, that was it, Magic. Totally waste of money. Let me know your opinion. See you into the next. Kisses in your face.